A teenager is dead and two of his friends are under arrest after a bizarre shooting in Marion County. Police say the victim and a friend were taking turns shooting at each other while wearing body armor style vests. West 2's Marley Martinez has the 911 call and the latest on the investigation. Hey, Thunder, hey, please, no, please. Sir, I'm getting them out to you. Frantic moments, a 17-year-old calling 911 after his 16-year-old friend was shot inside this Bellevue home. My house, my house is not shot up. But police say that was a lie. They say what actually happened is the caller's two friends were taking turns shooting at each other while wearing an armored vest. Please, bro, I love you, bro. You got to stay with me, bro. No. Sir, I've got help coming out to you. I need you to take a deep breath and answer my question so we can help your friend, okay? Police say the young man who was shot, Christopher Broad Jr., died. And I saw a teenage boy come outside all hysterical screaming. Joe Van Houten is an Army veteran who lives next door and saw the immediate aftermath. I was always taught from a young age, you never play with guns. Police say three friends reportedly lived at the home with one of their fathers and that day had a couple more friends over. According to arrest affidavits, one teen recorded Snapchat videos that first showed the victim, Christopher, shooting at a 17-year-old wearing a tan plate carrier style vest. Another video shows how they took turns with Christopher being shot at five times by a nine millimeter handgun. It seems weird to me that they would have a body on their vest. I mean, why would you have one? In the report, the alleged shooter said one of his shots struck Christopher in an area not covered by the vest. The medical examiner says he died of a single gunshot wound to the chest. The report says one of the teens told police they've shot at the vest before and no bullets went through. The alleged shooter also told police the gun belongs to his father, who leaves it at home for protection. A sad deal that teenage boys being, you know, I guess being teenagers, not realizing the possible consequences of what they were doing. In Bellevue, Marley Martinez, West 2 News. The alleged shooter is now charged with aggravated manslaughter. The other teen is charged with providing false information after police say he blamed the shooting on other people, including saying the house was shot at by unknown suspects. We are not naming the two teens arrested because of their age.